In this video we share Our Lady's message to Gisal Arcadia for April 12, 2022. I am the Immaculate Virgin, the spouse of the Holy Spirit, the humble servant of God, the mother of Jesus, who was betrayed, mocked and humiliated. Even today that sword pierces my heart. Children, you are at a crossroads, make the right choice, my son is waiting for you. I will protect my faithful and humble children, who have distinguished themselves for courage and love. My children, repent, recognize your God as the only God and Savior and He will forgive you by His great mercy. Now I bless you my beloved daughter and thank you for having welcomed me into your heart, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. For several years, about a thousand pilgrims have come to Trevignano Romano every month to experience the encounter with Mary on their knees. It all started on August 22, 2014. Then the Italian couple Gisala and Gianni Cardia went to Medjugorje to pray over many difficult matters on the spot and thank them for the gift of marriage. They brought from there a small statue of Our Lady, Queen of Peace, the prototype of which stands in Tyalizna. After a while, strange things happen in the Cardia home. Friends who come to them for prayer together experience healings of minor ailments. On April 21, 2016, Gizala was praying alone in peace. Suddenly she hears whispers. I thought Gianni was watching the TV. After a while the voice became so clear that she had no doubt, Our Lady was there, Gizala tells us. My child, my daughter. I am the Holy Virgin, do not be afraid. I chose you because you are filled with love and hope, and they are the foundation of life. These are the first words that Our Lady spoke to Gizala. After a while, she assured Gizala that she would confirm her presence in their home. And in fact, soon the statue brought from Medjugorje was flooded with bloody tears. Tears also appeared in the image of merciful Jesus hanging in the Cardia family room. Thank you for supporting my channel. May God bless you and keep you. Our Lady, Queen of Peace, pray for us.